the necropolis and just like wrestle the Lich King person. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We Punch grapple him. him. Let's just have low CMD. I know that. Right. <laughs> yeah, All right. That a long time to learn so, power. Uh, so sheep uh, effectively uh, has wished for more dragons and has not told me that was his least favorite part of the campaign. <laughs> Just with two few dragons. Dragons. Or would they that he wanted to see more well. dragons? Mm-hmm. Okay. I mean, I, I, I'm just honestly not sure if that's just my inclination that I, I like dragons more than well, others. Well, 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 or help. if it really was like something that should have happened but hasn't so yeah. far. Well, how does everyone else feel about uh, having seen few dragons in this campaign? Oh, too many dragons makes them seem mundane. We've heard about dragons a lot. I don't know. I haven't felt a great sense of missing dragons. Yeah, that, that might just be me. Which like is... we, there was the great silver dragon that got murdered. And we haven't talked to a lot of them, but that's generally because we've been too small fry for them to deal with most of the time. But we're, yeah, we, we are big fries at this point. Well, yeah, but, but none of them are really... Those, uh, those three red dragons that you spotted above the battlefield whenever you, like, had your duel with Frostfist, those would have gotten involved had that gone any other way besides a single one-on-one duel. Didn't want to deal with those. But uh, I can say for the dragon's experience that they look down at effectively, like, this nearly unscathed, like, solidified army and went, eh, we're good. But if you guys had gotten into an outright bloodbath with the bandits, yes. You would have had three large red dragons on the battlefield. Mm-hmm. So, uh, so how does anyone else feel about Sheep's opinion? Uh, dragons are not required. But have has the lack of them, like, impaired your enjoyment, Gogur? No. Okay. Dark? Yeah, I wouldn't say they've impaired my enjoyment not having more dragons, so I would be, I am kind of, part of me does want to see more dragons in the campaign. At least, you know, a, bit more, a little bit more interaction with them, in some sense. But, you know, they are big, powerful creatures, and in a sense, you know, they, ha- they have quite a, um, quite the large story effect as a whole, you know. As I said, I don't, think it's ru- I don't think it's ruined anything, not having them around, I don't think it's a bad thing, just, you know. Personal preference. We don't want to fight dragons. Oh, come on, we're, 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 we're all trying to go into the damn abyss. Hey, Griff, how do you feel about what Sheep said? I like the amount of dragons that have been experienced so far. I don't feel it's lost its uh, sense of allure. When you encounter a dragon, you're like, holy shit, this is a dragon. You're kind of rare, aren't they? That's right. When I show you guys a dragon, now I know Sheep wants to see... Oh, wait, he'd want to see any dragon, right? <laughs> I am I am teasing sheep, but uh, I I do think that is your sensibility. Like my sensibility is more undead, just far more undead on it. Funny how this uh, how this campaign does have undead involved in some capacity, huh? How about that? Sorry, guys. <laughs> well, there was there was your attitude and also the arc mage being around and also Gogur's character had a relationship with the Lich King. We we had we had a decent amount of Lich King. Yes. On your yeah. body. You had some Lich King representation. Yeah, I wonder I if would I have more like undead than like more uh, dragons. Actually. Yes. Uh, there was the uh, the Archmage got involved because three people having a connection with the Archmage. Um, the Great Gold Worm uh, got involved because that was the primary focus of Sheep's character. Uh, the uh, the three ended up getting involved basically as they're diametrically opposed to the Great Gold Worm. Uh, the, um, the Lich King got involved because of Gogur and Dark's characters, and the High Druid got involved because of Dwohirim and Gogur's characters. The Dwohirim, like, Manica and Gogur's characters. Yep. <laughs> and, uh, the, the book advises, like, don't have too many icons being involved in a main storyline if you're gonna do that. And everyone get confused as shit. All 13 icons! <laughs> and then the story just Everyone's invited. Yes. The spreadsheets you could make. Yes, the spreadsheets. Uh, you all have any complaints about this session? Like, I mean... I enjoyed it. Yep. Thoroughly. I mean, I, I have to say I expected the the actual, like, getting to the place to actually involve traveling rather than just teleportation, although it does make sense, I suppose. 
I feel like so far, apart from Aranos, the rest of us just haven't been necessary yet. Oh. Which, in a sense, is a good thing. Does everybody, does everybody really want to be involved? In I, mean, I mean, you like this story does involve like your character. We've just like done like role play interaction. Like these yeah. people here are highly interested in Aranos. You've been places where people are highly interested in <laughs> Aurelia. <laughs> I, I'm not. I'm not saying that right, right. it should have been different. I'm just. Yeah. I'm just stating my opinion about. Things. Right. I know. I. I mean. I understand. Yeah. I. I kind of feel the same actually. That uh, uh, my character is more like a glorified bodyguard. Right here, and uh, can't so, really do much. Yeah, we are hard. supposed to be kind of sure, but bodyguard. still, uh, I mean, we're not gonna have that you that much of an impact on the situation here. I uh, I disagree with the opinions as expressed. I think right. you folks definitely will have uh, impacts. Should you choose to want to have impacts, mm. maybe you yeah, don't we'll want to have impacts. impacts. Gee, that says a lot already. I suppose the, the answer is that we haven't been here for long enough to see the picture of where our where to put our our, our beef. Yes, you, true, yeah. you you guys just well, like like only saw like Aylor. Yeah. Okay, I'm afraid I do need to go to sleep. You're nope. afraid. Don't be afraid. I'm afraid. Then you can sleep. Get out of my face, Griff. You you're afraid of dark. Sorry, I'm, dark. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm sorry, Griff, but I can't let you leave her. Well, I'm gone. Bye! Bye. There, let's get him off. Yeah, he's already on. Uh, in that case, yes, I, I do understand that. And also, just, you guys didn't spend that much time in the wild wood, so... Yeah, I, it, there wasn't, just wasn't enough time yet. Right. Sure. You, you, hell, you don't even heard as of Medica, like, you don't even know where to put your beef yet? <laughs> Is that what you said? Okay. Yep. <laughs> I, I mean, I haven't yeah. seen the high road as yet. You can make a plate of sure it. When I don't know where to put my beef. Hmm. Also, have meatballs or and uh, and while uh, and while you know, you know, you, you know, the butterflies did convey that the entire group was welcome to come along. It was just uh, it's Prince Aranos that is getting you in the door. Yeah, I got a relation. With but the uh. Well, if, but the Raptors was not. Yeah. It, it is not just the icon relationship mm -hmm. die there. It's mm -hmm. also the one unique thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which uh, will be uh, continuing to express itself. But yes, all of your characters are the ones who've like built and achieved so much. Mm -hmm. yep. Am I correct in, in in saying that your unique thing is that you smell gems? Yes. He he smells. <laughs> gems smell like flowers, and flowers don't smell at all. All right. <laughs> now try working that into like a thing. Yeah, you have garage triggers, as guys. Ah, what underlying? Uh, welcome, welcome to the welcome to this building, which has hundreds, hundreds of flowers. Actually, a stone <laughs> elemental. Like, like it's a uh, maybe, maybe that could be it. I don't know. It's a mystery that I don't think will be unraveled in this campaign, because oh, I don't yeah, know. Right. I welcome, don't know how welcome, to unravel it. <laughs> welcome to this glorious mansion where there are hundreds of flowers made of crystals. Oh, good. Like, uh... You know, you know, as the book says, there might just be some people who don't want to have an epic story told about their one unique things. Like, oh, just fuck it. Just, no, I don't want it. Fargus had well, his, I and Fargus is had dead Fargus already. Yeah. Well... You're the one who said that you are okay with Fargus' story living on in Dwoherum. Yes. Then, then, then you got, <laughs> and I then died. Then you the <laughs> <laughs> well, if you wanted his story to continue, then damn it, you would have saved Dwoherum. And look at where we are. <laughs> well. Hmm. We also found out your one unique thing, of course, now, Master. Right? Yes, you did. Probably. How many of you suspected that? I I had my I had my suspicions from something that came up, but I didn't but I didn't know a hundred percent until the session. Mm -hmm. I I definitely didn't know. No, me neither. All right. I kind of knew. <laughs> me me don't too. Don't say. Yeah. I, I was did, not surprised. I did enjoy Aaron us looking at Olia like you just had to go there. <laughs> Well, you know, it's kind I, of I, I did not know your one unique thing was you were the only male. Yeah. Only got sisters and like 30 of them. That I did not know. 
<laughs> all, on all the lineage of elf queens extending through the ages prior. None? Until now. It's magical bloodline and everything. So, future elf king. No, I'm not inheriting because I'm not a woman. <laughs> or maybe you'll change that. Maybe there maybe will be that. others. Maybe after that's the you. destiny. You know, there's lots of scholars who have made guesses and, and yes. interpreted stars and whatnot, so. Mm -hmm. Could go anywhere. Will we have an elf king? At some point, when there are enough prophecies, they stop to matter. <laughs> Just pick one that you believe in and move forward. Just become guesses. Yes. You know? Yeah, I, uh. I do understand that the roleplay was heavy focus and also shined on Aranas as one unique thing, but uh, wouldn't worry too much about that. I mean, you guys got to take a load off your feet, see someone else have to deal with bullshit that isn't like Great Gold Worm or like Dwarf King drama about, no, oh, you don't honor your obligations! <laughs> uh, I, also just enjoyed a nice, I did also just enjoy a nice stroll through um, Newport, though. Hmm. Yeah, it was very nice. <laughs> you know... It's a location which the PCs have been to a lot of times, and like... it in itself is a important location for some of the characters. Yes. We spent so much time there, after all, that hey it's a location that matters. Hey guys, you need to do something. You can't. This is not going. This is not working. That, that's what that basically told me. In my mind, just this. I'm, I was just imagining how much worse would this have been if we didn't help. Yeah. Well, a lot more dead people who weren't bur buried, so... We did all we could. You know. Maybe we can do even more. We probably I, stopped, uh, like, rampant cannibalism. <laughs> you know, uh, you have certainly, as I've told you folks on numerous occasions, have made a positive impact on the campaign world, and the choices you've made have mattered. Yeah. It doesn't go completely to shit. Yeah. I, I, I don't want to tell you everything that supposedly mattered with stuff, because then you'll be like, no, spoiler, state secrets. Mm. Indeed. I don't want to hear that shit. I, I want to show you how I make the sausage go. You're like, no, oh, <laughs> no, <sorry." laughs> I don't want to know that it's not as good. No, then, then no I'll just sausage. keep thinking about it. <laughs> Do that. Keep no. it in your head. I am, uh, I am surprised that you folks... Uh, I will say that my expectation was that you would meet with the High Druid this session. I did not think you guys would be like, two weeks? We can't fucking wait that long. <laughs> uh, well, I kind of need to go to bed because I need to be up quite early tomorrow. I'm on holiday, so... I, I just had my busy day of the week. Bye, uh, I, I, have a, I have a convention to prepare for, so... Oh. A drinking convention, I'm sure. No, <laughs> what the fuck? That's not all I do. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> yes. Okay. I don't or believe I... you. I think you have an ulterior motive here. <laughs> <laughs> so you're not gonna drink at the convention? <laughs> I'm not, no, I'm not gonna drink at the convention. <laughs> fuck. How can you trust a sea raider? They got 12 prisoners. Uh, why do you guys think I'm an alcoholic so much? I don't think you're an alcoholic. You know, why do you have to bring sweet. that up? It sounds like you're being defensive, Goku. <laughs> Sounds like you're being an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> That's typical, Grub. <laughs> I guess so. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, you should know that by now. You've watched enough of uh, my shit. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that right there. I just forget at some point. Oh. Well, then I'm happy to remind you. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> fine, fine. Bye. Uh, bye, Gogur. Take care. And then you're he just on. leaves. Like, I know. The hell? What kind of guy? Well, who does that? I know. Griff. Yeah. You're on holiday, man, a guy. <gasps> so scandalous I cannot to stay relax. up so late. It's crazy. It's like, uh, today I've checked like my email like four times and my schedule three times. This, this sounds like the last time you were on holiday and preparing it's, for the Song it's of that Ice and Fire terrible, like, campaign. It's that terrible study anxiety that there's something I forgot to do or something that I have to remember. And I there probably isn't. But I just cannot make myself sure of that. I, I love it. Probably isn't. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm in a very similar situation right now. I, I I'll be starting like my bachelor thesis in slightly over a month, and literally the only thing I have to do until like two weeks from now is wait for responses to my emails, which are supposed to, you know, arrive like sometime next week. Mm -hmm. But it it keeps feeling like I have to do something, but. 
I don't know what it is, and that makes it worse. <laughs> And maybe it is something, but it's not. Even so. like checking my email feels bad. Yeah. Like I dread checking my email, even though I know there's not going to be anything there. How long? And I your, feel like I have to do it anyway. How long's your break, Manikai? Uh, just, just that's the end of the week. Oh, you did say week long, I reckon. It's uh, I, I man, holiday just doesn't work for me anymore. I, no, it's I, I am stressed out. <laughs> And not like you know. <laughs> it's you not stress dark. It's not, it's not <laughs> how it's supposed to be. I had a an exhausting day today, and but you, I was am stressed. I, I do recall you mentioning that in the group chat. Oh, all right. Oh, I, I had double lectures today instead of just single. I, I hope the session was relaxing all the same, and that your your little private excerpts and blurbs that I gave you, even if you weren't Aranas. Give you something to get, think about. Get to escape. Right, right, sheep. Hmm? <laughs> exactly. I, I blanked for a moment. You better believe that thing's coming up again, sheep. Oh, yeah, that thing. Yeah, yeah. All people you, you know mind. that You know, there was an Archmage 5 that got bounced back when Lord Taraptus did his fiddling. Still hasn't told me what the hell... You found out. I, no, then no. Again, I, I, I didn't ask. So. He, he did give you a nervous look whenever he walked into the room. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot to ask him about that. <laughs> yeah, it was specifically for you, and he basically just turned away and hit his face. He's like, oh, so embarrassing. Like, I hope she fucking just forgets about it and, like, just fucking just let it go. <laughs> uh, and then now, whenever she sees me, she's going to be upset about the whole, like, teleportation thing, and she'll completely forget. Or rather, we'll just wait until the moment Teraptus looks the most stressed, and then ask him. Oh. <laughs> or really, you could choose not to go see the Hydra and be like, So, Teraptus, <laughs> buddy! You know what I just got the others to agree to me deciding? Whether you stay here for the rest of your life or get to leave. <laughs> <laughs> You wouldn't do that to him after he's everything like, he's no. done for you, right? <laughs> so there was this question I had, and I must remind you that you want me to be happy with you right now. <laughs> Blackmail to Raptus. <laughs> Make him go back to hating you. <laughs> At least you know where you have him, then. Huh? <laughs> you know I have the evocation talent, right? <laughs> Kills both right now. Right. I don't know what that means, but I surrender. <laughs> <laughs> he also has that crazy one, so it's like Tereptus has evoked a bowl of wild butterflies. Yeah, uh, I can confirm he also has the disintegrate spell. That's uh that's pretty high level. That's a three hundred and twenty damage. Boom. So you're killing me half. twice, is what I'm hearing. It's a, it's an intelligence plus level versus physical defense. Leaf on win for half. <laughs> <laughs> I still couldn't survive that. Huh? Does it target multiple people? No, it's one. Oh. Crap. Yes. In addition, if the target drops to zero hit points from this attack, or drops to zero hit points before it saves against the vulnerable effect of this attack, it is gone, dusted. Nothing remains. No negative HP from Disintegrate. And no resurrection either. It would have to be a uh, pretty fucking awesome, like... There is only one type. Like, it doesn't get better than that. There is a feat that allows you to just, like, use, like, part of a body. <laughs> with, you're like, this does count as, like, part of a body. <laughs> it's a strange feat to take, no, no, Because you're not going to no, no. use it that many Here times, ever. Here we go. Ninth level spell. You no longer need to have most of the corpse uh, to perform the spell. Yeah. So the ninth level version of Resurrection allows you to do it without having most of the corpse. Like, take my one nine level spell make it Resurrection again. <laughs> Just lock all my spell luck spell slots out for the level. And I, I would most assuredly say that if you as a player character wanted to bring back someone who used who got disintegrated and use one of your ninth level spell slots, one of the few times you can cast the spell in your entire game, I'd say sure. Yeah. Yeah, reasonable. 
The ninth level spell killed you, and the ninth level spell could bring you back. <laughs> Why not? But, uh, yes. That's, uh, the sort of power that Taraptus is wielding around. He is definitely an epic level wizard. Oh, uh, we could take him. <laughs> as, we uh, probably could, as a group. As a group, sure. But, uh, one of you one may not survive the encounter. <laughs> Now, the problem is he's a wizard, so you can have multiple if you wanted to. So, initiative. <laughs> it comes into initiative, and he is human. Who's the most person he hates the most? Aurelia? Probably not me. I'm probably, like, more indifferent, really. If it was going to be anyone, it would still be Aurelia, <laughs> yes. <laughs> the thing is, I don't see... I, don't, I see apathetic, 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 it, kind of like, and Aurelia. Especially if Aurelia, like, blackmails him into that position. <laughs> Because at no. this point, he actually likes Aurelia now. Or, yeah, it's kind of an awkward relationship because Aurelia likes Teraptus, but not what he stands for. So And uh, Teraptus likes what Aurelia has done for him and for the Empire, but has difficulty forgiving her past. You know, at least we agree on the whole conflicted relationship uh, thing. Yes, it's like how, uh, how Aurelia feels about Horizon and its inhabitants. It's like, they like me, but this place is terrible. I, I like the feel it I captures that uh, conflicted feeling. The sun went down quite a few hours ago, so... Yes. Your batteries are running out. I know, like, <laughs> just, just, just unwind, Manikai. You don't have to go to sleep. Just keep relaxing. I begin to feeling sort of a haze in the back of my mind. That means that I'm gonna just... Like, I, I usually... I sleep really well, always, pretty much, by... Laying down and then just being gone, and this, everything's just black until I wake up. So that's, that, that's how you don't relax, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I can, I can, I can feel that coming on soon. So uh, I'll, I'll pass out, you no matter where I am, if I don't go lay down. That guy so. is call host. So bye, group. Yeah. Bye. Thanks for the session. Bye. I'll yeah. talk to you Thank in two weeks. Thank you, Grim <laughs> Well, we, we do oh, other yeah. things this week. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hope. Sheep. <laughs> I mean, Manica is also doing one of them, isn't 